what I am going to show you is a very interesting uh, effect uh, which was uh, originally done by one Russian uh, filmmaker his uh, name is uh, Kuleshov I do not know how to spell that but it is called Kuleshov. Uh, he was a filmmaker and this, uh, this has been done I think long time back it is in early stages of filmmaking that uh, this thing was created right. So, he had uh, uh, see it is something like 1929 uh, this film was shot and uh, the best part of the film is uh, uh, whatever theory I had told you about editing. Uh, this has come because of this gentleman who created some very good experiments in editing and uh, he put a theory saying that uh, if you have if you put certain videos along with others and then the story starts building up. So, it is like I show two different shots uh, still if I connect them together then you start suddenly having a story in your mind because there are two shots uh, back to back being played for you. So, uh, with that to prove that theory uh, he actually had one uh, very interesting situation explained. So, there are uh, suppose there is first shot where uh, uh, you have uh, so you have a uh, gun and which is pointed towards the camera and you have a uh, gun shot right. So, that is one one of the uh, one of the shots and the other shot is um, of a person maybe who is uh, smiling and looking upwards. So, he is he is looking at you and suddenly he is looking upwards and he is smiling these are the two shots you have. Now, if I show the first shot as the gun shot and I show the person smiling slowly upwards then you feel that. Uh, the gun was fired, but he did not get it because uh, because of which he is smiling and looking up. If I reverse the, uh, the scenes I, I put this person laughing first and then there is a gun shot you may feel that he was the one who was targeted and he was killed right. So, this there is no rhyme or reason uh, there is there is no continuity here there is no uh, common point here the persons are different the shots are different Maybe they are taken from two different films also does not matter the moment they come next to each other they start telling you a story and uh, this was Kuleshaw's effect and he had given many such incidents. So, one of the incident was uh, another uh, group of things he, he explained and that was uh, three shots uh, and one shot he explained was a uh, car explosion. So, you have a so, you have a car explosion as a shot other shot is of uh, a car going uh, with uh, some fire slowly some fire starting to pick up and there is third shot where uh, maybe it is a top angle where people are running out of the car. Right. So, these are the three shots. Now, uh, if I if I number them as 1, 2 and 3. Now, there is a different story every time I renumber uh, rearrange them right. If I say that 1, 2 and 3 is my sequence then the story is that car had explosion and uh, when it was the fire was getting lesser and lesser four people came out of the car right. If I make it 3, 2, 1 then it looks like people came out of the car then slowly fire started coming and then it was exploded right. There is completely different twist in the story whether the people were dead inside or people were alive outside is decided by the editor not the script writer here. So, he can completely ruin your script if uh, these kind of situations are available. So, uh, even in toy making these goof ups can happen. So, if you show ki wo box ke andar ka pehle dikha di aur baad mein upar ka box bana hai to ye kaise bana hai fir andar ka ye sawal aa sakta hai pehle. So, you have to have a chronology of things 
and he had he was the first person to visualize these kind of problems in video shooting nobody else so far had thought about these problems ki agar ye shot teen aise hai aur kisi ko bataya nahi gaya ki iske sequence kya hai then they make make this mistakes also and this was a, a very important contribution to the film industry what kuleshaw did uh, we are really lucky that we have uh, some film from that time also uh, what he had shot and that is why i thought we will see this film and this film is about similar points now so what he has done is a very important uh, theory of reaction shot so whatever i say if there is a reaction to this then the story starts building up so uh, he has used this theory now and you can see three situations now where uh, he has used the reaction shot the idea he is he has used only one reaction shot and three different action shots and still you have uh, you can see that every time he has a, a combination of two shots you have another story so for example what let's see what he has done so this is the food what we can see and this person is uh, watching it so you immediately have a story that okay maybe he is hungry or maybe he is a waiter and he has delivered it on the table or whatever there is just one shot of a table with some food and a person watching it so this one one way of story now we are using the same shot of that person we are not changing that shot and let's see what happens so look at this so you have the same same reaction shot of the person he is still blank and you see a coffin and a baby uh, lying inside that so you know now he is a father in pain and maybe he is he is uh, not able to react to the sudden death of his kid or whatever now you know there is another story now right so so there is one lady sitting on the couch and this guy is just looking at it looking at her and this may trigger some other story now so every time the reaction shot was same you don't even know whether it was from the same film it was from another film if these people have whether they have come in front to each other ever in their lives you don't know but still if i arrange these two shots one after the another you get different story every time and that was the effect what kuleshaw tried to explain to people that uh, every time you you have the editing as a tool in your hand there are lot many things which can happen and that was uh, the basic point which he wanted to make and we are really fortunate that he did that right so uh, because there are so many film schools in the world and everybody has to teach this kuleshaw effect they have given assignments on this kuleshaw effect that go out and shoot three options of the same reaction and uh, let us try and edit that so if you search in google for kuleshaw effect you will find wonderful videos on uh, how students have reacted to this and how they have created their videos so like I, i had done the google search you can see like there are so many uh, kuleshaw experiment uh, videos available and every time they have tried something else so one person has tried uh, action of a person that he is angry and uh, he is looking at the camera very angry face and then slowly he lifts his axe so uh, to this reaction shot they have they have a uh, shot of some uh, outsiders coming and then they are uh, trying to cut some trees and this guy is uh, angry that he wants to go and cut these people maybe so something like that there is another shot they have used of hitler where he is uh, um, challenging people that come join the army and all that and they have used the same shot that he now he tries to pick up the weapon and now he wants to go to the uh, army or something and he has they have used another like somebody is picking up his child and uh, taking them away or kidnapping the child he is still using that act so every time his action is same and they have used another uh, shots to explain that so it's a very interesting experiment to do so i thought i will uh, show it in this class today we will uh, continue with some of the videos who is this deepak and deepak and kailash okay this is 
respond to one with every child laughs. This is not a risk of slightly spinning. The body grows from one end to press it and flatten it. And then with the scissors, you cut a kind of a cut a slant here and cut a slant on the other side. So you basically get a pencil point. It's like a spear point. If you look from the side, it looks like a baby cut that's mark, which can open and close. It looks like a mark. Now this mark is like a reed, a reed which vibrates and produces sound. Now I'm going to pick about two inches of this, about five centimeters of this, put this in my mouth and blow up. the videos anything you wanted to say about this okay except for the fact if you remember uh, the that size of the titles was bigger than the presenter's name also uh, so which is not a good sign right <laughs> so the presenter's name which was coming horizontally here somewhere you had put in right somewhere you had put arvind gupta but uh, the size of Arvind Gupta name and uh, editors Kailash and Deepak was much bigger also because it had uh, some uh, right like this now. So uh, that is not done first of all and uh, secondly I keep on coming to this point that very few people have used any graphics to explain what is happening there. Also uh, we get unnecessary loaded with the speed at which the video is going on. So, we somehow uh, close our minds to saying that okay, agar koi cheez hame ye 100 percent speed mein mili hai, to hum usi ko use karenge. So, like you have a shot of that reed vibrating, ek hi camera mein ek hi shot tha wo, wo bhi jab tak Kailash ne zoom kiya tab tak uh, Arvind Gupta ne nikal liya tha wo, right. To ek dam bhoot chota sa shot mila tha wo, jab reed dikh rahi hai, thik hai. To wo usko agar aap close up karke, utna hi close up ko agar aap speed bhoot low karke use karte utne pure time ke liye, to aapka ye sara jo dhandal hai wo dikha hi nahi deti na. You have, you have tried to capture with this camera, that camera, but wo kahi dikh nahi raha hai. It is always in the long shot. 
सो पीपल आर नॉट एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड कि क्या दिखाना चाह रहे हो आप जब तक कि वो रीड का बात कर लेते हैं तब तक शॉर्ट खत्म हो जाता है और वो आगे पे चले जाते हैं कोई दूसरे टॉपिक पे सो द कम्युनिकेशन इज नॉट हैपनिंग आप लोग वहाँ खड़े थे इसलिए आपको समझ में आ गया जो भी बोल रहे थे बट फॉर अ न्यू पर्सन इट विल नॉट बी कम्युनिकेटिव एट ऑल सो दिस इज अ वेरी प्रोमिनेंट मिस्टेक जब तक वो रीड समझ में नहीं आ रही है किसी के देन दे कैन नॉट एन्जॉय इट सो आर यू पीपल एबल टू विजुअलाइज वॉट आर द मिस्टेक्स इन द वीडियोज वॉट वी सॉ एंड एनी वे आई हेड शोन यू अ कंपेरिजन विथ वॉट यू सॉ ऑन पोगो राइट द काइंड ऑफ सो शुड वी डू वन थिंग दैट वी वी गो बैक टू आवर मशीन्स एंड ट्राई एंड क्रिएट अनदर सेट ऑफ वीडियोज ऑफ द सेम थिंग नाउ शुड वी डू दैट नाउ यूअर्स इज स्लाइटली डिफरेंट वॉट इज द नेम टोर्नेडो This toy, this tornado, is basically two 1.5 liter bottles, and they are attached with a very special kind of a double cap. These are two caps back to back, and with the help of scissors, you make a very nice hole, even hole in them, right? You can either stick them with aryl dye or M seal, and then put tape on top, so both they become a kind of a double cap. So this is like a double cap over here. You can put a bottle on the top, and you can put a bottle below. Now the lower bottle is filled with water, and now you invert this and you swing this. And if you see, now slowly there is a tornado over here. It's like a swirl, and you can see it's like a funnel-shaped thing, and the water comes down around the periphery, and there is a hole in the middle, and the air from below goes on the top. Once the top bottle is emptied, you can again reverse it and give it a little swirl, and you can see this fine thread. And later, it becomes into a huge funnel-shaped tornado. We'll go close up. It's get tight. Back to back, and with the help of scissors, you make a very nice hole. So this is like a double cap over here. You can put a bottle on the top, and you can put a bottle below. Now the lower bottle is filled with water, and now you invert this and you swing this. Now slowly there is a tornado over here. It's like a swirl. Okay, I think that was uh, quite nearer to what we wanted. Uh, apart from any comments. the third time tornado was not necessary right it was slightly a drag but uh, they have made exact use of the material available so they went on the website so cap banane ka nahi dikhaya tha so search on the web get that process add it right so it is easier to so, jab tak wo bol rahe hain hum log wo baju ke char frame dekh sakte hain aur samajh sakte hain ki kaise banana hai theek hai and then uh, actual process is nothing you just have to swirl it and keep it There was nothing in the toy to be made. The main cheese, जो बनाने के लिए थी, वो caps की थी. So वो बता ही नहीं थी अरविंद गुप्ता ने. So how to how to make that? Editing table पे तो आ गया अब shooting करके. So we don't have a chance to go to Pune again and do that much of shot. So what do you do? So that was a very good via media. Except for the fact some points where the colors were little jarring about the the pink and the red were and also ज़्यादातर हम लोग जो आपके टाइटल्स है वो ऐसे टेढ़े मेढ़े होते हुए ज़्यादा देर तक नहीं देख सकते ऐसा लगता है गिरेंगे अभी कभी ना कभी सो 
So, some of the titles were like slightly wavy for no rhyme or reason, but there was something very interesting also. For example, they had shown the close up uh, in a picture and picture uh, in when the long shot was being shown. So, that was showing exact tornado shape what was coming right. Also, the quick recap can also have audio, why do you forget that? So, you can uh, quick recap me up, bol diya yaha pe, lekin sir bolne se nahi, so you have to also have the audio of that right quick recap. So, it requires editing quick recap ko pandra just paanch uh, ya dust sentences me jor bola hai, usko do sentence me fir se bolna matlab editing ka bhaat bada kaam bad jata hai. How to capture exact essence of that, but uh, once you can do that then it is very easy, but logo ko sawaj me a jata hai ki kya karna hai. So, it is important. Anyone else has done something? We have Devendra also. And then we want to replace the 
Kodexus Ampras, who pays for the fact that not to be without being supervised by the by those who can see and draw the law. So this is a great thing for the Bushmi Chan too. How long is this? <laughs> How long will it go on? <laughs> that was the best way to get credits. <laughs> That was very well uh, given credits for actually. <laughs> uh, today in that uh, the film festival which I attended, so in one of the films uh, they had a very good drama about uh, what is development. So they had a very good sequence of two people fighting over what is development and what is not development. And uh, at the end of that they had a full montage of some pictures like this. They are beautiful pictures of uh, Bombay both sides, the Bombay developed side of Bombay and the slum Bombay and uh, how is Bombay life. So uh, I asked them because uh, who shot those pictures, they said Google shot it for us. <laughs> so I said good that you gave credit to Google also for this. So what this looks like? Right, okay. So the point, uh, one more thing what I can, uh, okay, let us see the CD videos also, right. Suppose if I shot the sand and I blow, then the air would 
kararlanmaz, koyu kral vermez. Yani bir dış kral, üstlük, burada idare ediyorlar. İpolosuzlar, tesbih edip etmeye de, hatırlıyor, şart da kurar. Ve o kral kral, tıklamaya bir kral kral değil. İnsan bir sürü de kurdara baskı. Ve ne olsun bu? Ve bu ya, bu dış kral, bu kral, kral kral kral kral, hem ki bir tabak yapmış, bir de kanal çöldüler, hem ki bir okuşu dağımız gibi bir şey. Çok biz kapıya bir dedik bıraktı. Ve biz kursu bir borcu ile sıkıyız. Ve benim basic principle of science. Ve bu çaydın science, studies in the king's cross of motion. Ve biz bu da sıkıyız, in the king's cross of motion. Ve bu da bir direksiyon, biz bu da bir direksiyon. Ve bu da bir direksiyon, bir borcu ile kapsan kumda sorun, hem de bir sürü bir kekinde yok bize direksiyon. Right? That's the only thing that comes out of the world that gives you the opposite direction. Both these persons will look at kind of a circle that block. Now we just see how it might work. This is the fat scroll. Then we get with this fat scroll. Then we just go to make two small cuts. This is a big one. The time will show it in the middle. Right? And now we're going to see both these ends like this. And so we press them. And we take a bit of tape. This is Put the tape like this, flatten this, huh? and send it to the other side. Flatten this out, take the tape. Now the next group is, you can use group of square bits of tape. And this is just the right size to go inside this. And over here, I just make a small notch. The purpose of this notch is if I shove this in, they will come out of the project. But then I get the, the right one and I just move it like this. Got a small piece and I'm going to say that this is small one for you. And still I'm going to go back to the opposite one. I get the, I get the such cut, small cut. So they are forced into the opposite corners. I put this straw inside this, right? Then divide. This is how this must look like. Okay. Um, so, uh, except for the repetition of the process, I think it was quite there because you had Arvind Gupta explaining the construction and then doing it again. So, you could have just overlapped that with uh, the explanation and you could have exactly half time of the film because we had to see it twice. So, uh, that was Tushar's one which had this uh, some audio problems I think in the recording itself right. Both the cameras ok it was common because I think the mic was being touched too many times by the speaker. Uh, so, we had to uh, I think that recording also was not really great ok. So, we have uh, seen almost uh, 10 to 15 assignments uh, in this particular section of uh, the toy which we wanted to edit. I have also shown you what is available on Pogo, right. So, based on that, now I feel that we should uh, we should create a toy with, with that as a template uh, and whatever the missing things what we found out now, if we can add up all of them and create a toy that will be much more useful than what we have right now because most of the toys what we have is kind of like continuous video of what, what was given. So, the editing has actually not uh, not been enforced too much to the extent that we, we can get it. So, that was uh, one missing uh, link we had and uh, now that it is uh, 5 o'clock we can have uh, those those two things uh, before that we can also see it once more with this another toy what is being made by this Rob. So, this toy uh, he again explains what are things are being. So, here he explains what is the toy operation like. So, this is it this toy is like this and uh, 
So, he explains that what is the toy first of all and now he will explain how it, to, it is to be done. So, especially in Tushar's uh, thing when he took a uh, he tried to use uh, keep his mouth away from the tube and the result was not seen earlier. So, you kept on the close up camera for a long time. So, the length of that tube which was like really huge if you had shown the other camera immediately it could have been seen very easily right and also uh, we have to remember that we need not have the chronology of shooting in mind. So, this shot pehle aaya to pehle use karna aisa zaruri nahi hai like Rob right now he was showing how the toy works. So, if you want to show that in the beginning that is ok, but you have to insert in between saying that ok these are the materials used and then start all over again with the process. So, uh, what right now is going on is we are using the recording as the uh, guiding line. So, recording ko hi rakhe hum log uh, usko hi usko bilkul hila nahi rahe, aage piche leke jane ki himmat nahi kar rahe bilkul. So, that is not true we can we can play around with the, the chronology as far as it makes sense and it is within our template. But uh, that will help us in uh, creating a better video out of all these things. So, uh, what I feel is if we have understood this template. So, nowhere, uh, nowhere else I saw that uh, scientific principle uh, was explained in come some toys, but there was no uh, slide or there was no title showing that this is being explained right now. This is the principle behind that the scientific principle behind the toy. So, there was no uh, no slide coming up that time. It was just an audio signal that ok he was saying that this is the scientific principle, but there was no visual mention of it otherwise it could have been very easy that uh, this is the scientific principle right now going on. So, that title could have helped a lot and maybe the, if it is very difficult principle you can type it also. So, that people will read it separately when he is explaining. So, you can have more than one ways of showing that principle but uh, I did not find anybody doing it. So, that is something which is very very missing and uh, that is the reason I feel that we will uh, we should have uh, one more round of edit on the same uh, videos what you have, but with the templates and uh, everything again in place in sense. Uh, so, how do you want to go about it? So, we will uh, we will go back and uh, do that edit and uh, uh, meet tomorrow morning for that will you require that much of time or you want to come back here and we will discuss that again. So, what is the option you want to go uh, go and come back here or uh, we will meet directly tomorrow morning option 1 or 2, 2 right. <laughs> so, that was very clear that people wanted the 2, but uh, till I asked them. So, uh, has a uh, Sajjan have you uh, got the answers for the quiz too ok. So, you have collected you did not have that uh, announcement type of thing right. So, we have uh, we have the judging done by us. So, this is in the order of uh, ok this is not in order. So, Sajjan has given half marks and quarter marks also now some places. So, the question was from where from 13 marks and uh, we have people who have scored 9 and uh, 7 and so far the highest is of 9 ok. So, we have a uh, couple of people from on 9 and uh, then couple of people on 7 and a half 7 and a 8 and a quarter also I saw somebody. Uh, what I will do is I will I'll just uh, announce the answers for the benefit of everybody, so that uh, you all know. So, ok the file extension for H, HDV was uh, what was that M 2 T right. So, how many people wrote that uh, you can decide on your own and uh, DIVX is a inter frame or intra frame compression what was that. Uh, anybody wrote that answer? So, it was a in inter frame compression. Uh, definition of a codec is a program used to encode or decode the video. So, I think that that must have been a decider because most of them may not have written in the same format. The PAL video has how many lines interlaced with how many fields? 
Okay, so this was this was pretty easy. So what was your answer, Devendra? Six twenty five by fifty. Okay, so you are correct. Uh, Six twenty five by fifty is correct, and it is written in a specific format. So uh, have you seen that? Uh, how is it written? So it is written as six two five, and then you have a small i, and then you write fifty, right? So this is uh, to say that it is interlaced with how many fields? Uh, VOB file is readable using what? So VOB file is what? It's a DVD, right? So it can be read in a DVD player definitely, but it can be also read in a PC because whoever has a DVD ROM, then they can read it. QuickTime video file dot MOV is compressed with Cinepack codec. Then default resolution used in MPEG-2 NTSC video is uh, what is that? Anybody tried that? Nobody. 720 by 480. That was the answer. What is the file extension of the video file in a VCD? In the, that everybody knows, right? So, uh, did you write that? Kailash. File extension of the video file in a VCD. You want the options also? इसमें से बंदा ए वन टू थ्री फोर टॉस करके बोलेगा कि सो सो इट वाज डॉट डैट ठीक है सो राइट द रेंज ऑफ बिटरेट्स यूज्ड इन द फॉलोइंग वीडियो फॉर्मेट्स सो एमपेक वन हैज अ रेंज ऑफ व्हाट फ्रॉम एलेवन फिफ्टी टू सेवेंटीन हंड्रेड एंड एमपेक टू हैज ट्वेंटी फाइव हंड्रेड टू सेवेन थाउजेंड राइट � that I saw most of them getting wrong. So, Ada Mark nahi dete hai kya isi isko? 2500 hoga to hi dete hai. Thik hai. Types of bit rates used to encode the video are which concept hai? Ye toh baut pahela number ka slide mein ta shayad. Ye sajjan ke. CBR and VBR. The CRT television has the aspect ratio of the screen. So this is not a CRT monitor, right? Everybody knows this is not a CRT monitor. So how to recognize the CRT monitor? कैसे पता चलता है CRT है या LCD है? हाँ? Size, right? वो बड़ा box होता है तो CRT होता है. तो CRT में aspect ratio क्या होता है? Aspect ratio is height and width, right? So what is what is the aspect ratio of a CRT? Four is to three, right? So Frame rate of NTSC video is uh, 29.97. It is not 30, but it approximately 30. And the full forms of uh, PAL, NTSC and SICAM is uh, Phase Alternative Line National Television System Committee and the Sequential Color with Memory. Okay, so, uh, so these were the 13 questions and the 13 answers. A uh, couple of them got 9, so uh, they can enjoy, uh, I will not tell their names right now and a uh, couple of them even got 2 or 1, so they can really think about it. So I will not tell uh, their names either, so they cannot be like unhappy for whatever they have done. But uh, apart from the, the fun part, it was also important to, to see that how people have uh, seriously taken up the course. So that was one uh, important prerequisite put in by Professor Fatak that he said that I would like to have some quizzes in between and you have to give me the, the answer sheets so that I can see it. So it was mainly for him that we conducted this quiz and uh, though it does not have any bearing on uh, your certificates, so you do not have to uh, really worry about it, but it was basically to see how people have understood the different topics. Of course, like we have been saying that all the presentations used in this uh, present uh, this particular course will be made available in open source. So my presentations and Sajjan's presentations would be uploaded on the website first of all. It will be followed by the videos of uh, the lectures and also the uh, editing which will happen later on. Uh, for the uh, I have a couple of other websites also to showcase, but I think uh, let us uh, let us go and start editing of these videos 
because that is what will take uh, much of the time. And uh, if there are any questions on this, let me try and address that because uh, what I feel is we have we have to come out of the lecture mode slightly. Uh, what I see in the videos is currently more on the lecture side what we have been doing. Or typically, ये हो जाता है कि lecture में हम लोग कुछ भी काट नहीं सकते हैं क्योंकि हमें मालूम नहीं कौन सा important चीज बोला जा रहा है. So we normally don't dare to cut anything there. But here it is a different story. We are making this video for a general public, which is supposed to understand how the toy is made. Now, if they understand how the toy is to be made with five lines or ten lines, it doesn't matter. So, whatever is required, we have to keep that much, and what is not required, we have to chop it immediately. So, we don't have to keep it because uh, it will only lengthen the process. So, with that point of view, I have not seen a very good editing which will satisfy all the requirements and uh, every editing looks a bit longish than what it can be. So, do not worry even if it becomes 1 minute, we are happy that it will become only 1 minute. But the communication part has to be taken care in various aspects like for the titling, for the labeling of diagrams, for adding up additional information using graphics for animation in the titles, I think one or two people tried some animation in the titles, others have just used the earlier titles. And uh, uh, moreover, the ex entire process uh, was not followed with the template what we discussed. So, we had a discussion on the template last time, right. We had seen some cookery video and we had also discovered a template, we had put up a time limit. So, that was uh, completely haywire right now. And there were no cuts in between when is the process starting, when is the material ending, there is no, no cut point there. So, it will be better if we have those cut points because I uh, will tell you why it can be the same editing can be used for iPods. Now, iPods have a special facility to click on the next button. So, you can go to the next link. So, in this case if I have four points in the whole video, first point is about the material use, second point is about process third point is recap, then I can just browse through that using my iPod also. And it is very easy for people to browse through the entire process. And they if they do not want to see the process, they can just go to recap. And that is very easy. Right now, I have to again search front and back, where is that uh, recap coming now. So, it is uh, very important to follow some template. So, I suggest that people uh, move down to the labs. Some people can go up in the labs. I do not see Ranjit today. Uh, so. Uh, whether the lab is open there, yeah. So, people can go to the respective labs and uh, you can take every uh, uh, machine will have uh, two people sitting and you can share any subject. So, yeah, you can take the person who owns the machine can take his subject and you can give the feedback and later on you can change your sitting positions and the other person can edit his or her uh, toy. So, that will be the uh, thing from now. I will keep on visiting both the labs parallelly whenever I am possible. I cannot be at both places at the same time, but I will try to uh, meet everybody in the lab uh, whenever we can and so that uh, we can finish it off by 7 o'clock maybe.